Look at the way you hold. You like each other, right? <laughs> I, I think that's very nice. You mentioned a certain orange man. He's back in business, baby, and he went to Chick fil A. And I forget, is Chick-fil-A racist or are they homophobic or something? But here he is just having a good time. This is a bit of a throwaway. I just kind of enjoyed it. Take a look. Look at the way you hold. You like each other, right? <laughs> I, I think that's very nice. Have a good time. Nice to see you. Thank you very much. So we'll order 30 milkshakes. We'll give them out to the people and we'll take some for ourselves, okay? Good. Thank you very much, everybody. Hello. This has got a great, great American franchise, Chick-fil-A. It is. It's a great franchise. The owner is a great man who is a member of one of my clubs, and he's fantastic. And, uh, yeah, they do very well. They're closed on Sunday. The Lord's Chicken. That's the Lord's Chicken. You're right. It's good chicken, too. Yeah, good to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, come on, friend. I'm getting one, too. Yes. Yes, she's fun right come, on in. come on in. Come on in. Come on in. We're going to get rid of Biden. Yeah. <laughs> And he's horrible to the black community. Like it or not, he treats that way the black the community bad. And check out his record in the 1990s. Check out his record in the 1990s. You're economically with four us. Look, it's just standard Trump stuff. First off, was his tie particularly long, like almost to his knees in that one? Someone's got to talk to him about the tie. But just like walking in there, he can immediately connect with these people. As far as I could tell, he didn't want to turn any of them into slaves. I mean, he was taking selfies with them, for God's sakes. Um, it's like he had lowest all-time black unemployment at that mm -hmm. State of the Union speech and the Congressional Black Caucus. I say this all the They sat there like this when he said that. I'm starting to think that orange man may not be racist. What do you think? No, I mean, Trump is so good. I don't know how you watch a clip like that and you just can't stop yourself from smiling and laughing. He's just so, it's so funny and he's so natural. And I remember being a kid in New York and Trump was in rap songs. People loved mm -hmm. him, right? Like he's generally been loved by the black community, also by the gay community, right? Like this is, this is a part of who he is. He is really a man of the people and Joe Biden is not. Trump is way more in touch with the average person. And, uh, and you know, the Democrats today are the same as Democrats of the past. They only like black people if they do exactly as they're told. And so Donald Trump, conservatives are saying, listen, we know that people don't need a, someone with a PhD to tell them inflation isn't as bad as you think it is, right? People understand their wallets. They understand their purchasing power now. They understand how different life is now than it was under President Trump. And they want him back. And they want a normal person who talks to them with respect and integrity and treats them like they know what's going on. And you and I both know being on the, you know, being in social media, seeing the comments we get in our videos, people are not as dumb as they're treated by this mm -hmm. White House. People know what's going on. They're not stupid and they're tired of being spoken to like they are. And so that plays definitely into the black vote, the Hispanic vote, right? People, people love Trump. It's exciting to see. And also I do love Chick-fil-A. It is God's chicken. So I'll just throw that out there. <laughs> I love how the guy's like, it's God's chicken. And he's like, yes, yes, it's God's chicken. Like it he is. just has that. He's just present enough. It's all sort of ridiculous, but also true and silly. And, and that's the whole freaking thing.